Hello, welcome back people. This is RobNob9x. Got a little bit of a rush game on Dan Van Peek here. There's just two uh, clips I wanted to show you. Um, so a couple of good tips here. So um, this one, you know when you're about to base jump down to the attacking objectives? Um, I happen to get in a helicopter here, but obviously also if you're um, you know, base jumping down, get your shoot out, um, try and go wide. <clears throat> so don't just go down to the main objective. Um, you've got A and B. Um, I'm not sure which one's in the little box, but you've obviously got the one in the big building and the one B I think is there in the little box just there. If you try and come wide, like I'm actually doing with a helicopter here, you usually don't get the enemies here straight away. You get down as quick as you can to the objectives. So I jumped out of the chopper here, ran down, and literally just no one, not even one shot taken at me. Go run straight to B and take it out. So just like that. And this gun isn't mine by the way with a flashlight on. I had to pick it up because I ran out of ammo. Um, I don't know why anyone would use a flashlight, <laughs> let's face it. <clears throat> so yeah, so uh, arm B, I just kind of waited here for a little bit. Um, just because, you know, if a, if a uh, defender comes, I just want to take him out before he gets there. So, you know, don't class this as camping. <laughs> and there you go, wicked. So um, B, I think that's almost about to block. There we go, destroyed like that. I think how quick that was, literally just came down as well. Um, so that's a good tip, just getting the chopper come down or just base jump, but go wide as you can. And then um, here, I don't actually know what I was doing, but I just thought the stairs actually led somewhere. Yeah. Idiot. Yeah, so then run, run to the building. I see all my men are on the right here. All kind of fighting the enemy here. So, just go the other way. Have a quick check. No one around. Smash the window. Straight way through. And then again, straight to the objective. Still not even an enemy coming here because they're all being uh, taken apart by my men around the other side. So I just went up into the room and look, I can overlook the objective perfectly. Look at that, see? Already there, I don't know how they got there that quick to be honest, but I can just uh, overlook them. And that's it, perfect. So um, just keep an eye on it, just stay in this room, just keep an eye on the objective. Remember the aim of the game is to destroy the objectives. So if you've armed it, and you're just covering it, it's, that's fine, it's not really camping. But there you go, MCOM destroyed, easy as that. It's a good tip for that one. So this next bit, so this is the uh, the two objectives. I think this is the first two. Um, first two or the second two. It might be the second two, actually, I think. Um, but yeah, so uh, just kind of missed his skis. I thought he'd gone round the side, but obviously got that wrong. So um, just went to reload. I love using the... Uh, I know it might sound a bit noobish, but the noob tube on um, on here is just brilliant now. I mean, once you've got your assault class all the way done up, the, the medic kit, if you're kind of running around trying to kill the enemy, you're not going to be able to help your men with the health. See, the noob tube, which is that extra, if you run out of ammo, just quickly use it, you know? Or if you can't hit someone, um, you know, gone around the corner, but the that life's already down, noob tube them, and you've got them like that. So just this cliff, you get so many people that just run off this little bit behind me there. They just come and come and come, because they, for some reason, they think that they're going to do it this time. So they carry on doing the same thing, and they don't learn. But if you just want to come up around the sides, um, I, didn't, I don't think I had a suppressor on this one, um, but one bit of famous here. Um, but if you have got it, it would help a lot, just because they don't, won't, don't know where you are. But um, yes, yeah, so this little bit here, see, they all just love running down here. So, I right, tried to stab him, just didn't work, so get rid of him. Watch the chopper's going mental next to me. Right, then we out, carry on running up. I think we are about to. Um, so, yeah, so you, you obviously can see the, uh, well, my screen is orange, but... Um, the square where their enemy is spawning and they'll literally will just keep on running down so if you can hide behind these rocks you can just literally just destroy them as they come down there's a sniper there so remember as long as you keep an eye on the map where the lines are drawn on the mini map so you know when you're out of bounds if you've got enough time you can go up take care of them and just get back into bounds I was going to stab him but <laughs> I definitely would have died myself I don't think it was worth it so yeah, just keep 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 an eye though. As soon as you kill one person, obviously you're gonna show up on the mini map. And someone else might show up. So uh, as soon as you kill someone, you want to make sure no one's around you, especially if you're gonna reload. Just try and hide behind the rocks whilst you reload. So I was literally just running around and looking for somebody. So there was people just everywhere. So I was running around, running around, and it's, it's just it's just fun. If anything, um, I had men down by the bases protecting those. So if someone did get through, they're covering them. Whilst I'm here, just wasting their spawns, just, just brilliant. So it's just, it's just fun to just run around this bit. Someone there, you're dead. 
and him. So again, that little cliff bit where I said oblivious to you. So you can just run around it, taking them out. Now this, look, what what is that? I thought like I, I stood there for ages thinking it was someone. It was kind of moving. I don't know if it was someone standing there with a sniper or something or what. And I think let me have a look at that. What? I think it's just a, a tree stump or something. But yeah, yeah, that kind of freaked me out for a bit. Yes, I remember I was just running around here. It was so fun. Um, yeah, so it's a really good tip with Rush. If you can, uh, if it's associated with a bit like this, where it's got lots of little bits of cover, or even on different maps, if you can run up, obviously you can't go too far towards their spawn, but just enough. And you can just, just run around, just start taking them out as they're running down, because all they're looking at is the objective, trying to get to the objective. They're not looking left and right. So you can easily just come around the flanks and just get them like that. So that's a good, good game. We actually we smashed this enemy. Um, I think, yeah, I've almost run out of ammo here. Three bullets left. Oh, where is he? Noob Tube? Yeah. So then Noob Tube, I do love it. So I was going to run back, try and get some ammo from someone. Just fell off that little bit by accident. I thought, nah, forget it. We'll just go kill someone with some uh, little pistol. Where is he? I think I've got someone around here. Somewhere here. I think i got him. There we are. I'm ready. Three bullets left in my famous. Yeah, yeah, buddy. Yep, so this gameplay is almost over now. So I want to say thanks to um, everyone that has subscribed so far. And if you haven't, feel free to do so. I'll see the little box on the screen there. Um, just click that and you can subscribe and you'll be notified of any more videos. Um, if you haven't, you can check out my other Battlefield videos and I've uh, got a couple of COD videos. Um, this one, look at that. Oh, stabbed in but got done. No, they finally caught on to me. But yeah, anyway, so thanks for watching this. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Thanks again. See you later. Bye.